Welcome to the Clarity Confidence Connection Summit, where women break through barriers, unlock their next level of success, and build bonds with other badass business owners. Your host for this session is Samantha Kaawa. Samantha is a best-selling author, speaker, former marriage therapist, empowerment coach for married women, and the founder of the GEMMS with Samantha Kaawa, an international coaching and training company. Her main focus is helping women become their best selves while staying in and completely transforming their marriage. Samantha has been recognized as a leading expert on relationships and is on a mission to help restore trust and faith in the world. She has been featured on Fox, ABC, CBS, and other international publications and podcasts, sharing her counterculture views on relationships. Samantha is one of the co-creators of the Clarity Confidence Connection Summit. She has another amazing guest coming right up. Take it away, Samantha. All righty. Yes, we're here. I'm here with Kelly. I'm so, so thrilled to see her here and have her speak on our stage. I'm just so grateful. I know her personally and professionally. And Kelly is the Chief Happiness Officer at Happy Me, a marketing and events company. She is the creator of Happy Body, Mind, and Soul Retreats and the chief curator at www.happyme.yoga. Kelly is a veteran wife and a mother of two growing boys. She is a certified yoga and meditation teacher and enjoys volunteering in nonprofit organizations where she holds a leadership role. Oh my goodness, Kelly, welcome. Hi, Sam. It's so nice to see you again on the opposite yeah. <laughs> of the coin, I would say. And Patty, yeah. hi. Hi, everyone. Welcome. Welcome. Yes. So thank you for being here. So Kelly, My I pleasure. just want to jump straight into it. I know we don't have too much time, but I would love to hear a little bit more about your story and how you became an expert in this area. Absolutely. I'm happy to share that. Well, it all started during the pandemic, believe it or not. I know a lot of uh, people experience uh, a shift right? Transformation during 2020. So my story was during that time, um, I have so much time in my hand, time affluence, right? We were all at home. So I delved into a lot of online studies to improve my skills, my digital marketing skills. So I took all the certifications I could get my hands onto. And then my friend introduced me to Coursera. And they said, uh, she said, they offer, um, Ivy League courses. So I chanced upon the science of well-being from Yale University. So I wow. really thank Dr. Laurie Santos for, you know, sharing her nuggets in, in to everyone. In fact, 4 million people have taken the course since then. Wow. So since then, um, I started, you know, getting serious about my well-being. I didn't even yeah. know or define it as I define it now. Before, I would just do, you know, exercise here and there. I did yoga on and off before. I even took my PE course in yoga or stretching in college, and I would go to the gym, I mean, yoga studio on and off and attend events with yoga. Mm -hmm. But then, um, after the uh, science of well-being, there was um, a four-week rewirement course. We heard this from Christopher earlier. So basically, um, we had a practice to rewire or retrain our brain. And uh, you can pick any activity or hobby or skill that you want to master. So obviously, my interest then was, you know, wellness, well-being, and I was starting meditation already way before to help me fall asleep. So there's yeah. a lot of like okay. problems being That's solved. So <laughs> yeah, and that so fast forward October, um, you know, uh, 2020, I created Happy Body, Mind, and Soul Retreats. Yay. So it's a passion project of mine, and my vision there was to um, connect coaches like you in the wellness space and um, put together a retreat for them because I do events and marketing. That's my background. I've worked in um, brands and agencies to launch products, events, and marketing in general. So I thought, oh, this is a perfect mix or, you know, um, 
marriage of the two, my newfound passion, which is yoga and meditation, and uh, my marketing skills. So um, I did the work, I call it the work, um, the, the next two years, right? And in 2022, January, one year ago, <laughs> you yeah. and I were working at that time together. And I just filed my LLC, the Happy Me. Yeah. And from there, and then I also, in addition, I I delve into um, yoga certification. Mm -hmm. So I, I joined my school, Yogamu, and I got certified in around, around uh, summer of 2022. Yes. Um, so they offered a founder's um, uh, circle wherein we became a partner. And that's how Happy Me dot yoga is born so happy wow. me dot yoga is a platform a wellness platform for people to cultivate mindfulness through yoga and meditation so we offer classes meditation yoga yurveda yoga therapy even coaching in the platform with uh, in partnership with the yogamu school so oh. it's an international school and there's like at least twenty nine thousand students as of today. So happy me that yoga, my company, in, and I offer as well, like, um, as you know, the uh, workshops that we're doing. Yeah. Class and the retreats. Mm -hmm. So there's kind of like three things there, classes, retreats, yeah. and the workshops. Nice. Thank you for sharing that. I love, and I loved watching your journey on how to get to, how you got to where you are today, Kelly. And it's so beautiful how you, how passionate you are about bringing together wellness advocates and, you know, coaches and professionals to support the community and all around us. So thank you for that. I want to dive straight into your five, eight, I'm sorry, five, Three A's to ace anything. I, I was adding two more A's. <laughs> A's. I can add two more A's actually. <laughs> <laughs> so what? Let's let's hear your first A today, Kelly. Okay. So again, this is gonna be. I'm gonna tie it with the science of well-being, and um, my this can be applied to anything that you wanna do in life, whether you wanna master a skill, start a new hobby, or start an own business like I did. So I'm gonna re relate my story to uh, the actions or the, the tips that I'm gonna be sharing today. So um, number one, letter A is awareness. As you told me, awareness is key, right? Mm -hmm. It's the starting point for everything. If you wanna change, you wanna transform your life, you gotta be aware, right? Like, oh, okay, then what does it take to be aware? you have to have that curiosity and open-mindedness, right? Yeah. So see, you know, hear things that are around you and, you know, be curious. For me, I delved into a lot of self-study. I love listening to audiobooks while I'm doing something like walking, running errands and all that. Um, even sometimes before I sleep, I would listen to it. And believe it or not, I've read <laughs> more books in in the last two years than in my entire 41 wow, okay. years now in existence. So I, yeah, I just love consuming audiobooks. So it helped me, you know, with my personal development and, you know, um, learning more about what I'm doing, you know, wellness, med uh, meditation, even leadership and um, financial freedom, all of, all of the things, all of the wellness component. And then um, the number one thing that helped me with this is my meditation practice. And I really recommend it to everyone. Um, in all the books that I've read, meditation is always there. Meditation is a, a tool that a lot of highly successful people use in order to unlock that creativity. Because um, as Christopher shared earlier, when we meditate, our rest and relaxation mode in our nervous system activates. And that's where creativity happens, right? When you're, you know, your mind is quiet and you're not running, you know, a thousand programs in your hand at one time. I was like that. I could relate to him all a hundred percent. I would do a lot of things. I would multitask and all that. And I think I'm, you know, productive and I'm successful, but I wasn't happy or highly satisfied with you know what I'm doing so this practice the the 
the moment I became aware of, you know, okay, and be quiet and silent and listen to my inner, you know, being or higher self, that's where the magic happens, believe it or not. I don't want to sound woo-woo, but everything just aligns. (laughs) It aligns, like... I found my passion and purpose and I I'm meeting people like you, like Patty, like the people in this room in this community. Um, and we're creating something wonderful, I, like positive yeah. beautiful effect, right? Yeah, I love that. And I love how you're bridging meditation with awareness, right? It's so, yeah. it's so key to get quiet and make space for things to drop in for our and, and you're talking about curiosity and open-mindedness and that's so beautiful. I love that bridge of, you know, that mindful meditation leading to more awareness. So Definitely. that is so beautiful, Kelly. Thank you for sharing. Definitely. Your- so I, I'm just going to add and connect it to the Ooh, second okay. A. So the, that's where the mindset change, right? When you become aware and you study and you do the inner work, you meditate, then the, your mindset change. And then you go into the second A, which is action. Ooh, okay. <laughs> the action, right? Yeah. This is also from your course. I'm learning a lot from you and from other people. And they're all like interconnected because they're true. They're universal truth. So um, the second A in acing anything is take action because it doesn't stop knowing, right? You know, you know things, you know how to do it. But if you don't take action, nothing will happen. Nothing will move. Inertia. <laughs> Everything yeah. in motion yeah. stays in motion. And <laughs> yeah. If you don't do anything, it's not going to do anything. For me, you know this, my story, I waited and waited because I don't think I was ready to start my own agency. I was freelancing for five years and I think I'm doing okay. And I'm still kind of looking for what am I supposed to do on this earth? My passion and purpose. It wasn't solid yet at the time. But right when I take the leap, when you told me, just take action. That's why you guys, you have to hire coach Samantha. <laughs> so <laughs> I took the action and um, everything just start unfolding from there. Oh. Yeah, so that's the second A, take action or action. Commit to it, be disciplined. You know, there are strategies and tools that I'm going to share in order to uh, to keep that going. So I'm going to use my meditation and yoga as an example. Okay. So um, once you commit, right, you take action. Okay, I'm going to do yoga and meditation. Then you have to set yourself up for success. And there are strategies to do that. Um, you've heard this from other people. Write notes, sticky notes, put it where you see it every day, right? Set an alarm on your phone. I have it, 6.30 meditation, 2 p.m. yoga. (laughs) And treat that as a sacred appointment, right? For yourself. And um, that way you can retrain your mind. That's, this is where the science come in because you have these cues and reminders popping in and you're seeing them everywhere. You can even put, put it on your computer. Like for me, I have a and a background of my um, creative, my board, my vision board is there. So I always see all of the cues. And now I don't even think about it. It's automatic. It's automatic now because um, our brain goes autopilot. Now I have to do yoga at a certain time. Or if I miss it at that time, I still have to do it that day. It's like you're craving for it. My body's craving for it. Yeah. So that, those are the it. things. Want it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so they're just a simple um, tips to um, make that um, action sticks, right? And achieve your goal, whatever you set, you set for yourself, whatever that goal is, those are the things you can do. And to add, um, just, you know, keep on going, keep learning and fail forward. Um, forward if, yeah. you, if you fail, that's okay. You can get back up and start all over again and learn from that mistake. So I love that. That's our second A, right? Action. Hashtag action in the chat. If you know how much taking that one step, even if it's the scariest step in the world, you know that moves mountains. You know that will move energy. You know that that has served you by taking action. So I want to see some hashtag action in the chat. There you go. Yes, 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 yes. Beautiful. 
So Kelly, what is our third and final A for today? The third and final A, I was going back and forth between accountability and a, a, association, but I came up with association because it encompasses all. So association is finding your people, your tribe, right? And mm, associating wow. yourself with the right group, the right people. They say you're the average of five people that you hang out with. So choose them well. And that's where accountability comes in as well. In order for something to stick and in order for you to achieve your goal and ace anything that you want to do, you have to have an accountability partner. And there's a science to it as well. Because when you share things to other people, especially the ones that you trust and you uh, some a role model in your life, um, the more that you're likely to follow through and finish it or complete the task, yes. right? So that's why it's very important to have, you know, coaches or mentors or even just a buddy, an accountability buddy, a mm. friend, a colleague, a boss that can help you really, you know, check in with you how you're doing and maybe give some advice if needed um, on, you know, what you can do better or see some blind spots. So. Yeah, so it's important to belong in a group like this. Um, I feel I feel like I couldn't have done it, didn't work with coaches and mentors. So it's just all so, um, um, you know, effective. Like I, yeah. I am a true testament to that. Like I couldn't have done it without, without you all, without the community. So I want to give back and share my experience to, with. Uh, women who can relate with my experience who want to feel better and be a better person partner mom name it yes well I what I love about what you're sharing with us today Kelly that is super profound and I think is often missed is that many formulas end with action right is the last step to success is action and yes I agree that it is that final component to really creating the success and really attracting things that you would love in your life. So yes, I do believe that that is like that final component. And what I love when you're sharing these three A's, you put action in the middle and you're ending it with association, with accountability, with the community. And that's so important. And it's just exactly what we're all here for during this whole summit, right? Is connection. And it's really surrounding ourselves with amazing people who we look up to, like, I look up to all of these speakers, right? I may be the host, one of the hosts of this summit, but I, as I interview each and every one of you there, you have such amazing stories. And I love that you're highlighting that in this, you know, th three A's to ace anything, um, being that we're human, right? We, we, we will find times where, you know, in one of the earlier talks, we were talking about motivation and we will find times where we're not as motivated. Mm -hmm. And this is exactly having those associations, having those friendships and community really helps us to keep going, right? When we absolutely, oh my gosh, so powerful, Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm learning, right? I learned so much. Are you proud? Yes. And, um, oh, I think we're, we may have frozen, um, Kelly, because I think I'm still good. Oh, there, Kelly, you're back. There. <laughs> I think I paused for a little bit there. You're fine. But what I wanted to highlight for you, Kelly, and I just wanted to shout this out to the group is Kelly is so amazing at doing things scared, right? Like taking that action scared, doing it despite whatever comes up for her. Because this, I, I, when Kelly and I were talking about doing this talk, she's like, I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready. I don't know if, what, what to say. Yep. And wasn't that amazing? Like I had so much comments in the chat today, Kelly, like, this is awesome. This is so good. So true. Meditation is key. So exciting. Oh my gosh. So no, I just, that's why I have to thank you for, you pushed me to do this. <laughs> well, and I think what you're setting is a beautiful example and you're such a good role model of this, of taking action despite feeling ready, showing up as your true authentic self. You are just such a 
I just, I, I love that beautifulness of your personality and your willingness to play and share and grow. Um, and, and so I just wanted to highlight that for everyone here watching today that, you know, if you, if you haven't taken that step and you haven't done what you know you need to do in your heart, like let Kelly's story, let her inspire you and then let her remind you to connect with all of us, right? To connect with this community. So Kelly has an amazing free gifts for all of you. And she is sharing with you a free one-year membership, everyone. This is her free gift. This is not her VIP gift. This is her free gift. A free one-year membership to her happy yoga. So Kelly, can you explain just really briefly what they will get with this? Yeah, so I'm happy to give everyone a fee one year membership because like you said, you know, like I said earlier, I couldn't have done this without a community like you. So I was fortunate that uh, you're in my circle. So I want to give people that opportunity, same opportunity. Happy Meet Collective and Happy Yoga is a basic membership wherein they can access. Uh, we have a daily sadhana or meditation group in our Yogamu school. So uh, a weekly huddle that I'm planning to do if we're, you know, all, you know, for it. I host monthly masterclass, monthly. So every month there's a speaker. Um, Samantha was one of them before and I have a coming workshop or masterclass this Saturday. So they can access that for free. And then in the future, I will add perks like discounts on the retreats that we're doing. And just all these amazing benefits. Yeah. Yes, I love that. And you also have a VIP gift to share with everyone yes. who are VIP ticket holders. And that VIP gift is the happiness course, 10 practices to a happier 2023. So uh, Kelly, can you explain that really quickly while our team drops in the, the sure. chat a link to upgrade if you haven't already? Happy to. So happiness course is based on the science of well-being. There are 10 practices there that you can learn, like motivation, empathy, um, accountability, um, flow, abundance, and all of that. So these are, this is like a workbook. It's actually a 10-week cohort that I posted on the website. So if you want to join that, we can start a cohort and practice together. But it's a self-study. It's self-based, but I highly recommend to do it with a buddy so yeah. you can practice it together because each um, practice will have activities. It will have reflections or questions. It's like a questionnaire, and then it will teach you, okay, well, this is how you can practice this particular uh, practice or skill, like motivation is number one there nice. in the 10 uh, skills. So I, uh, I want to stress that happiness is a skill. So Ooh. it can be learned. So these 10 practices, if you practice it in your life, you will feel happier. That's why I said my title that be happier you in 2023. Nice. So that's, that's what it is. Thank you, Kelly. That is so amazing. If you haven't upgraded to VIP yet, go ahead and click that link so that you can get Kelly's amazing VIP gift and everyone else's, all the other beautiful, amazing speakers, VIP gifts as well. So before we head on out today, Kelly, I would love for you to um, share with us some final words of wisdom. I'm happy to. I'm honored, actually. Um, I recently um, had an interview with Thrive Magazine, and I shared this five uh, things that I wish I knew when I started. So I'm not going to elaborate on it, but I'm just going to uh, state it. Number one, know your why. We all know why. <laughs> Number two, surround yourself with like-minded people like this. Um, and you, we talked about it extensively today. Um, number three, keep learning. Number four, fail forward. And number five, give back. So oh. that's my words of wisdom. Thank you for joining us for another amazing session on the Clarity Confidence Connection Summit, where women break through barriers, unlock their next level of success, and build bonds with other badass business owners. For recordings of all sessions, plus an amazing VIP gift bundle full of courses and resources from our knowledgeable speakers, you can upgrade to a VIP ticket for only $97. If you have any questions or run into any challenges during the summit, email our support team at breakthrough at clarityconfidenceconnection.com. Stay tuned. We have another fantastic speaker coming right up.